So I just happened to drop by at the PB Hotel and I want to see. It's almost the same company as Banyan Villa, but I'm going to check and see how the room is like here. Maybe next time we can try this hotel. Hopefully there's lesser mosquitoes. Let's look at the view here. Is that a nice view? Oh, so here's the room. Check out the room. Very nice. Not too bad. Hmm. Spacious room. And a little balcony area. But the view here is much more better. Right, Brindley? You don't care. And we've got the toilet here. And shower area. Simple. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. PP Hotel. Very easy. And then there's a little swimming pool over here. Look at the swimming pool. That's what the swimming pool looks like. Small swimming pool, about the same as uh, Banyan Tree. <sighs> what is up you guys? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today we are heading back to Phuket, back to Patong. I'm gonna miss this place again. But I had my butter chicken. I did. And that was what I was craving for on this trip alone. Success. <laughs> man oh man, oh boy, it was tasty. It was still tasty as usual. I think that pretty much sums up my PP Island holiday for this trip. It rained a lot in the morning. Now it's clear. Well, I think it's gonna rain again. But uh, yeah, low season. I'm still happy and I enjoy the rain. It's sometimes good to be in the room, listening to the raindrops. It was fun. I wasn't even disappointed that it rained during my trip here. But I mean, guys, look at this. How could you be disappointed with a view like that? This is fantastic. Ferry is at 11 o'clock. It is 10:30 now, and hey, we've got our bags. <laughs> Not all my bags. Some of them are the other customers or the other guests, hotel guests. But yeah, they put it all into this rolling cart, and then we don't have to carry our bags so much. Brandley and Shaq are already walking towards the pier because you know, small feet, small legs, don't move so fast. I really enjoyed my time here at PP Island. I did. I really did. Though it was a short, quick little visit. I enjoyed it. But now, now my holiday starts. Now it's time for me to enjoy, relax a bit on my holiday. Whew. We are heading back to Patong, but we are staying back at La Vintage, aka Papa Palace. It's like home. It is like a place where I'm used to everything. I'll see you when I reach Patong and lots of construction going on now. Goodbye, PP Island. Shaq and Brandley. Bradley's got three seats all to himself. I got three seats all to myself. Shaq got six seats all to himself. Wet wipes, incoming. I need all. Oh, good catch, huh? Bradley, sit down. Good boy. Alright, we have arrived at Phuket. Now it's time to on board the ferry. And this guy, sleeping already. Check. Good sleep, Check. Good sleep. Not really. Good sleep. It's raining, Bradley. Raining. Let's go, Bradley. And our ride is here. Alright guys, we're back at Papa Palace. No, La Vintage. No more Papa Palace. But uh, yeah, 
Okay, this guy, you remember him, right? <laughs> Everything's still the same. Um, we got upgraded. No season. We are back in the Hello Kitty room. <laughs> yeah, look, white and red. <laughs> All right, we got upgraded and we got the pool view. Woo! Look, really, it's Hello Kitty. Look at that. This is Hello Kitty. This is new. Look. All right, Shaq, enjoy your alone time. With? With alone. With Spider-Man. Oh, yeah. because you say alone time, it sounds so... <laughs> Shaq is going to go watch Spider-Man at Jung Salon, and then I will have the responsibility of looking after him. And then, once he comes back, I will go to Jung Salon to watch Anna, the one that I talked about the last time. This is the problem with the baby, because this guy... He needs attention. Why don't you bring him to Anna? No. Is age no. restricted? Yes, it is. You could bring him to Spider-Man. Oh. <laughs> yeah, no, no. I, I don't need him spidering around when I'm watching. No, no. All right. Have All right. fun. Have fun. Yeah. Come back and tell me 10 out of 10. Can I give 11 slash 10? All right, Brandy. I bought food. Brandy, we got club sandwich. Woo. Is it good? And they're watching TV. Oh my god, the whole day. Shaq should be back. 10 out of 10. Nah. The saving grace, however, was the end credit scene. Mm. And now it is my turn to go head out to Jung Salon to catch a movie. Yay! The rain has stopped, but the floor is still wet. But that's good enough for me. And here we are, back at Jiang Salon. Ah, heading straight to the movies. It starts at 7.45, it's already 7.40. Oh, I miss this place. It felt like I just returned from the jungle or from an island. I did. And just like that, I made it to the cinema. Woo! It's good to be back here. Got my ticket. Now for the popcorns. Oh yeah, corn cheese for sure. And a mixture of paprika. Guys, the popcorn here is amazing. Oh yeah, guys. There you go, paprika and corn cheese. All right, I'm heading to the movies. I'll see you after the movies. Heading into the movies. Got my drink. Huge popcorn. I'm ready for this, guys. Here's the cinema. Here's what it looks like. Oh, huge. Well, that was a good movie. I really enjoyed it. This, this would be my first ever movie review in overseas in Phuket. <laughs> okay. Focus. Is it, is it okay? Sorry guys, I have to come out to the balcony because Shaq and Bradley are sleeping inside. So, I have to do my movie review over here and yeah, we are fogging. Okay, hang on. Fogging! The thing is, it is so cold inside and when you come out, it's hot and humid, even at night. Well, it's not hot, but it's just humid. It rained a lot. So here is my movie review for Anna. This movie is either you love it or you hate it. I personally do not have a problem with this movie. If you get annoyed with movies that goes from four years later, two years ago, six months ago, three months later, back and forward. If you're the type of person who gets annoyed with this kind of stuff, this movie has a lot of it. It jumps to the future, to the past, to the future, to the past. And I get why they do that. It does have a purpose in this movie. It does flow through the story. It does make sense to jump back and forward. Because in this movie, if you were to just go on a straight line, you're giving away too much. However, I feel like they could improve on the structure a bit. But it wasn't too bad. The storyline was great. I was surprised that this storyline was great. The action scenes in this movie, the fight scenes in this movie, all good. And then how realistic and how fight scenes go in this movie is awesome. There is lots of blood in this movie. I feel like this character Anna has a purpose. Good character building. You do feel for this character. You do feel like she wanted to achieve something and at the end of the movie she gets a goal. In terms of storyline it is beautiful. I thought this movie was predictable. I was wrong. Then I thought that was it. I was wrong again. There was a couple of twists to this movie and I love it. I love it for the simple fact that it was not predictable. Overall I will give this movie a solid 8 out of 10. Uh, I feel like it's enjoyable to watch. I feel like I was into the movie. My only problem with this movie is that it takes a while to build up. Towards midway of the movie, I felt like the pace starts to pick up a bit and things starts to happen and then everything starts to make sense. It was beautiful. This movie was made beautifully. So yes, I guess that's pretty much it for my movie review for Anna. 
I'm glad I watched it. I wasn't disappointed. I knew that this was really a good movie to watch. However, it's really far from being a Black Widow movie. I feel like there's too much realism in this movie as in terms of like the blood and all this. All the scenes in this movie, I don't think Marvel would actually approve to have scenes like that. There were a couple of sexual scenes. There were a couple of gore scenes. And then I don't think that the upcoming Black Widow movie would have something like that. Alright guys, I think that's it for today. And this is my day. I'm back at Patong. Now is the time where I relax and enjoy my holiday. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you in the next one. You guys keep smiling. See ya! Oh, finally, on holiday. Finally, I'm on holiday. I probably might still vlog. It's just not as intense as the last couple of days. Okay, they are sleeping. I can't talk very loud. See you in the next one. See ya! Bye! It's been great. This trip has been so great.